I'm sure you also have soiled white towels that are not in their most pristine condition. I have a tip and trick for you today. For these three hand towels, I will be soaking them in 500 mils of bleach and eight liters of room temperature water. You will leave them overnight and then wring them out and then pop them into the washing machine at the highest temperature and then they should be coming out spick and span. Wow, these towels are looking absolutely spotless. It looks like they're brand new. So I would definitely recommend every so often treating your towels like this if they are soiled because the results are pretty miraculous. Please subscribe! Recently, I saw this video on Instagram that piqued my curiosity and it involved mushrooms and the lady that did it basically cut off the stalks and then mixed it with capers, sun-dried tomatoes, breadcrumbs, and that was the basis for the filling. So I thought to myself, this sounds like a really interesting accompaniment to any dish that I might want to have. And I think especially since I am a bit more health conscious these days, I think this is something we should feature on our YouTube channel. So let's take a look. So the recipe calls for mushroom stalks, which I will rip out as like so. And I am going to fill these up with the mixture, but let's pull out all the stalks for now. So now I am going to chop up these stalks into little um, uniform chunks. I think I'm going to need a bigger bowl to mix everything in. I forgot to mention, I think we should add some garlic because garlic tastes good in everything. So let's add this to the bowl. Now let's add two teaspoons of capers. In you go.
I think that these sun-dried tomatoes are ready now. I had to soak them because I bought them kind of um, dried. So yeah, I think that um, it's been like about 20 minutes. So let's chop this up and then dump it in there. So let's also add this to the mix. And let's add a little bit of breadcrumbs to bind it all together. Okay, that should be it. So let's get our hands dirty, shall we? Oh wait. oh wait, before I forgot, let's add some pepper to this because I like things seasoned. So let's mix this up, mix it all about. You could definitely smell the capers and the garlic and also even the sun-dried tomatoes. Okay, so... I would stuff each mushroom with this mixture. I'm just adding a little bit more black pepper to it because I think that you can never have enough black pepper. And the recipe also calls for some extra virgin olive oil to give it a nice glaze. Okay, so let's put this into the oven for 20 minutes at 190 degrees. And I can't wait to try out these stuffed mushrooms. Well, it looks like the mushrooms are done now. Look at them. Doesn't this look amazing? So I think it's time to tuck into one of these lovelies. Why don't I choose this one? I could eat with my fork on the left hand side. So I'll do that, Marcus. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. Um, this isn't like your traditional um, breaded mushrooms because you do see that sometimes in the restaurants, but this is a different take on it with its own ingredients. And I think that it's relatively healthy because there isn't any cheese or anything like that in it. It's basically just capers, um, sun-dried tomatoes, um, breadcrumbs, um, not too many ingredients other than olive oil, but no, it just adds to the deliciousness of this, um, simple, simple meal.
So I basically wanted to say that this is a quick and easy way to get some vegetables into your stomach and it's really fast, really easy and I would say give this one a go.